All right. All right, I am not a seamstress. I am not. I am actually a hairstylist and a mom, and but that makes me kind of everything. So today's Daisy's Mommy. birthday, right? How old are you? Six. And yes, my house is a complete disaster. I will tell you why. Because I have three kids born this week and three birthday parties to get ready for. And that means that my house is a mess because I'm doing stuff like this. So what we're doing is, Daisy, what do you want for your birthday? Um, what did you want? What did you ask me for? Mm -hmm. What is this? Elsa's sleeves. Elsa's sleeves. <laughs> you wanted Elsa's sleeves for your birthday? No. I what did you want? Elsa's dress. You wanted Elsa's dress. And everyone knows that that's an impossible request I right now. Put your arm in. No other. Lambry, what do you want? Um, this is my sleeve and I and I want my dress for my birthday. And Amber is the only October birthday in her house. Yeah, she's kind of left out. She has this crazy red hair and an October birthday. And <laughs> I'm telling you, you guys, nobody got ready today except for me. And it's because I had to go to the school and sign some papers. So Amber and me and the house is just a disaster because of this. But this is what I did. So I went, I called all the stores. Of course, there's no more Elsa dresses. And Oh, I'm not spending $400 on an Elsa dress on Amazon. So I went to the DI, Desert Industries, and I just got blue and like bright blue dresses, like everything that they had. <laughs> and I found this one. It's from David Bridal's. David's Bridal? David's Bridal. And it had the like, the shape of Elsa's dress and the color and these pretty like jewels right there too. So I thought, oh, that's perfect. It was brand new with tags still on it and it was like the tag said like $130 but it was 35 bucks at the thrift store so I thought okay whatever I'll try it I'll get the $35 dress and it was a size 6 woman's so I went ahead and got my sewing machine out my sewing machine is horrible it's like breaking and everything but it's getting the job done good enough so we got it out and we just sewed along one of the hems to make it smaller for her on both sides like I pretty much just took out an entire panel just how you would normally just take in a dress but it was taking it a lot in so now that fits her really well and the zipper is still there and everything it's pretty much still a good dress and the nice thing about it is if I needed to take this out I could just I'm leaving all the fabric in there I could just take out that seam and make it a little bit bigger if she grows out of it or if I decide I need a fancy dress with added on Sleeves? No, I'm, I'm never going to wear that. Wait, was that an adult's dress? This was an adult's dress. <laughs> yes. Not anymore. So let's try it on, Daisy, and see how it's looking. Okay. Ambry, is it What's your birthday? Yeah. No, it's, no it's, it's Daisy's, right? All right, so we're going to zip this up. Just put it all over her clothes so it will be tight because she has clothes underneath. Do you like this dress, Daisy? Mm -hmm. Do you think it looks just as good as Elsa's dress? Mm -hmm. Okay, so you can turn around. You can see that this is a pretty good fit now. And like I said, I'm not a perfect seamstress, so yes, there's little things like this, but it's a, it's a dress up. And it goes all the way to the ground, which is fantastic. That's what we wanted. And then I bought some white sequenced, where's the sequins are on this side? Some white sequins like flower. They kind of look like snowflakes. Close enough. Right, Daisy? And your name's Daisy, and they're daisies, so that's cute. So we're going to go ahead and find a way to sew. I'm going to probably gather this and then sew it along the back of the dress. So I'll just tuck it in there to kind of show you what that's hopefully going to be like. And then it goes onto the ground like she wants. And I might even Velcro this so that... If we want to go to the store or something, we don't have to have it dragging on the ground and we can just take it off. Right, Daisy? Mm -hmm. Do you want to be able to take this on and off? Or do you want it to be sewn on all the time? Sewn on all the time. Uh. <laughs> okay, so right now, I, and then I found this awesome nightgown 
which I don't know why this nightgown was at the DA. Seriously, I, I really wanted to keep it. It was sad when I had to cut the sleeves off because it was so silky and pretty and like, I don't know how someone parted with this. Thank you because I really enjoy the sleeves from it. Anyway, we took the sleeves off and I don't have a serger. I would have surged the edges. If you have a serger, do something like that. And stick your arms in. So I made them to daisy size. They're nice and fitted. So now I need to figure out how to attach the sleeves and another little piece. Because if you see in the picture, Daisy, don't mess with that for a minute. In the picture, she has a little bit of fabric. Look up. She has a little bit of fabric that comes along right here that connects like the sleeves and the back. I need a little bit of a back section. And so I'm going to use the fabric from the beautiful nightgown to somehow construct something that hooks these sleeves all together and so onto this dress. It might be difficult. This might be where we go wrong, but we'll see how it turns out. All right. Yeah, Daisy, who has the best mom in the world? Me. <laughs> <laughs> Ambry, who has the best mom in the world? Yeah. You're funny. Where's Daisy? Where's Daisy? There she is. Okay, we gotta figure out how to put this. Okay, what's happening? Um, okay, so I took the actual sleeves off of the nightgown and just sewed them skinnier and cut off the extra like this is how much extra we have left so yeah so I could probably make like a whole nother sleeve out of this and I probably will because I have a three-year-old that wants the same thing so and then um and then I used the back part of the nightgown also because it was already had some lace on it and I just measured it and cut the sleeves off like where I cut the sleeves off I just measured it to her back and cut it a little smaller and then I just kind of guessed on making this piece in the front and now the trick is going to be to sew this on all the way around and try to decide how it might just be like permanently on her body and she'll have to wear it for the rest of her life um, at that point no that's about where I am right now so I'm, I'm gonna be able to make it and either not put it on her ever and just like It'll be cute, or... Daisy, do you want to leave it on forever? Do you want to just wear it forever? Or never put it on? Or never put it on. Should I just sew it on to you right now so that you just have to wear it the rest of your life? You mean sew it to my skin? No, just like sew it on and then the zipper won't work anymore and you just have to wear it all the time, every day for the rest of your life. Unless, you want to be Daisy Elsa? Daisy wants me to break it. No, okay, Daisy, I'm just teasing. I'm just teasing. The only way that. Okay, I was just kidding. I'm going to figure it out, okay? Mm -hmm. Do you believe that I can do it? Say, so you can do it, Mom. You can do it, Mom. Alright. Alright, we're done with the dress, except for I was going to add a belt, and we, okay. we need to do the belt still, but um, I spent like four hours on the dress, and then. <laughs> realized that we were all starving and we didn't have dinner and my house was a total wreck. Like if you thought it was a wreck in the last video, you should have seen how it looked before I actually came here because I let the kids just rip the house apart for three hours while I sewed her dress. But do you like your dress, Daisy? Do a spin. Let me see the back. Oh, oh we don't have the back on. Here, put this on. All right, so here's the back. Walk away, walk down that bench over there. So now we are at McDonald's because we didn't have dinner. At Daisy is Elsa. <laughs> is it your birthday, Daisy? Okay, walk down. Hey, Elsa. <laughs> You're funny.
Zaid. Zaid. <laughs>